That reminds me, guys, if you're not following me already, hit follow so you'll know, you'll get the notifications for when I go live. Wow, it is bright in Burbank today. Definitely. It is hot, 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 hot. It's hot in Topeka. What would Valadar think of you being a fan? I think Valadar would approve. <laughs> When I first did Validar, they said, give him a slight Hispanic accent. And when I did, it sounded totally like Puss in Boots. So they said, let's pull back on the Hispanic. And, uh... <laughs> Fear me if you dare. Hot or nighty. Every time I saw that, I thought of Mambo number five. A little bit of Naruto on my knee, a little bit of Gohan in my voice. What? I went a little crazy with fidget spinners. I went to a con recently in Australia, no, New Zealand, and they had tons of dealers that had nothing but fidget spinners. I got voices in me egg, and I let him out sometimes. Sometimes they even pay me for it. <laughs> hey, everyone, type where you're uh, you're joining the chat from, where you hail from, where you call home. We know some UK folks are, are tuning in. Everybody, just type in a state or a country. If you're not in the U.S., Columbus, Australia, England, New Jersey. Hey, what's up, Nab Doc? Yeah, New Jersey. I'm sure New Jersey people hate that, right? It's like, we do not sound like that. Shut up. Just like Canadians, they don't like it, eh? What's that about? I don't talk like that, eh? I'm from Texas. And we do sound like that. We got a thick southern accent. Now, luckily, I was able to to rid myself of it for the most part whenever they hired me at Funimation. Next time on Dragon Ball Z, good old Goku's gonna take it up with Majin Buu and there just ain't room enough for the two of them in this universe. Was DBZ my first show? Yes, it was, Bobby. It was. 17 years ago. I was already a fan. I became a fan of Dragon Ball Z in about 1995. And then the Canadian English dub came out, the first two sagas, the Saiyan and Namek saga, Namek saga, whatever, came out and then it went to Texas with the third season. And then as that was wrapping up, and as the Cell saga was wrapping up, I came on board. And then I got Ox King, <laughs> and then I got the narrator. And then I got West Kai and Pygon and General Light, oh little lamb, and Captain Chicken. He's in the last episode of Dragon Ball Z. Captain Chicken away! Episode two ninety one. For those who are keeping up. <laughs> 